Hello and welcome to day 13 of our Grow With God devotional. I'm Kaitia Lamore and today we're talking about a question that many people ask and it's what is God's plan for my life? Like does he really care? And I'm going to let you know he doesn't. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. He loves you and he does have a plan and this is the scripture that goes along with it and that's how I know. Um, Jeremiah 29 11, a lot of you may have heard this. This is one of my favorite scriptures. It says, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a hope and a future. Three times in one scripture, it says plans, 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 plans. You'll hear this a lot from other people. I've heard I've heard this a lot from many people actually. They say God doesn't care about the details of your life. Basically our job as Christians is to get saved, read our Bible, pray, and then figure out the rest. But what if I told you that God wants to partner with you in order to show you the plans that he has for your life? That's not only exciting, but honestly it's a relief that you don't have to figure it all out on your own. When I was in college, my professor had us do an assignment and it was to write down our five, 10, and 15 year plans, our goals. I had such a tight plan for my life, going to be a producer at a major production company, all this stuff behind the scenes. But then the more I developed my walk with God, the more I realized that he had a different plan for me. And I basically felt like he pulled the rug out from underneath me. And ever since then, I've been kind of just like, trusting in him and figuring out where I'm going. But it's been a lot of comfort in the process, even though it's been like, I don't really know where I'm going. I have a lot of peace knowing that God is in control and my life looks nothing like what I thought it would, but honestly, it makes a lot of sense. Everything that I'm doing now makes perfect sense with all of the gifts and talents, all the learning and schooling and experiences that I've had. So I wanna give you an assignment this week get out your notepad or your laptop however you write things down and just sit before god just wait just pray just ask him lord what is your plan for my life can you give me details for that this is how i knew about things that god has told me about my future and about current things that i'm doing is sitting in prayer and just waiting and things that started to come into my mind that were in line with his word and made sense for where i'm going so if he tells you to rob a bank that's not him but for the things that go along with his character and your talents and stuff, start writing them down. Even if it seems huge, open up a school, what? What? Have my own company, what? Like it may seem like, I don't know how to do that. Of course you don't, because God wants to guide you and send you the right resources. So write that down, but also ask him, okay, show me if this is you. Make it clear, give me detailed instructions and open the doors for me that I'm gonna need to walk through in order to see this out because he will confirm things every single time. He's not just gonna have you be like, okay, go, and like you'll never hear from me again. He's gonna make sure along the way that he lets you know. So let's go ahead and cover this in prayer. Lord, I just thank you so much for your plan for our lives. When you knit us together in our mother's womb, you had a reason for us specifically. And I pray that those who are wondering, what is my purpose? Why am I here? Is there even a reason? Please help them and show them clearly what it is that you need them to do. Let even today them get new revelations about your plans for them, things that are exciting, things that might seem a little scary because they're so big, but help them to just believe it, to believe it and to walk forward and to move in step with you. And I pray this in Jesus' name, amen. All right, you guys, that's all I have for today. If you have any questions or comments or concerns, go ahead and leave that in the comments section. And if you want to support me, there's a few ways you can subscribe to this channel, turn on those notifications so that you don't miss a beat. And also prayer always helps. Thank you for those who have prayed. Thank you for those who are going to pray. I really appreciate that. And two ways you can do it financially is to buy my merchandise. I have a link to my merch below. And I also have a PayPal link where you can send a secure donation through PayPal. Any amount helps. And if you're wondering what is this devotional you're doing this is your first time hopping on one of my videos I have an ebook it's a 31 day devotional called grow with God and it's free for you to download on your phone your laptop computer tablet it's there for you take it everywhere you go and let's go ahead and keep this journey going we're almost done with week two can you believe it you made it <laughs>
Okay, I'll see you in my next video. Until then, be blessed. Bye.